Okay, so this is a book I've been, I've just finished, Points of Entry. It's by Nadeem Farooq Paracha. Uh, it's got a very nice cover, um, quite a nice cover with uh, various kind of Pakistani icons on it, including uh, Imran Khan, Nazia Hassan, uh, Benazir Bhutto, her dad, General Zia, Jinnah, Qadi Azam, Alexander the Great, funnily enough, uh, who obviously went to Pakistan and returned from the River Jhelum, went, and many people in the northwest frontier province are thought to be descended from Alexander's armies. And this is a statue about somebody from the from a place called Mohanjadaro and Harappa, which is the actually the oldest known civilization that we have, I think, um, archaeological records for. Uh, that's in the south of Pakistan. And um, it, they think that's the kind of basis for the kind of Indus Valley civilization. Anyway, um, it's called in Points of Entry, Encounters at the Origin Sites of Pakistan. And it's uh, by a guy called Nadeem Farooq Paracha. And it's about his, um, his kind of, it's a collection of essays that he wrote. He's a journalist. It's a collection of essays that he wrote about things that he was interested in. And it's very kind of eclectic, so it's kind of about um, his travels in the area of Mohanjadaro, his reflections on that, um, his thoughts about Pakistani pop culture, the music scene. Um, he talks a lot about General Zia and his effect on Pakistan, which he feels is pretty much mostly negative. And um, it's... Uh, uh, and and just kind of reflections of his life and how he feels that that's contributed to to Pakistani culture. But it's not one big story. It's a like I said, it's a collection of of essays, and um, he's actually a very good writer. I think he's a very good writer. Um, he's he's the kind of Pakistani that is quite liberal. Um, you know, you know, he he's you know he he. he He's very open about certain things like taking drugs when he was younger, even drinking alcohol and 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 he actually there's a whole chapter about the whole alcohol culture in Pakistan, which I thought was quite interesting. Um, and yeah, he does kind of uh, to some extent some things he does kind of shine light on some of the hypocrisy in Pakistan as well. Um, but he does come across as somebody who's who definitely believes that there's such a thing as a kind of Pakistani culture uh, and a separate Pakistani culture and he writes about it in a very honest way. Um, I thought he was a very good writer. Uh, I enjoyed reading it and the fact that it was different essays meant that it kept the book quite interesting and it was different, um, you know, he, he went on to different subjects. Um, so, it, and, and, and a lot of them are about people. Um, so he talks about uh, certain concepts um, you know that you know that 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 are quite interesting. Like you know, a lot of Pakistanis will recognize the whole thing about people claiming to be from certain types of lineage or lineage from the Prophet, even and things like that. And um, you know, he talks about how you know some of these DNA tests that are being done now are actually blowing some of that out of the water, and that none of these people have any of that lineage taking them back to whatever so which is something i've always suspected anyway but it's nice to see it actually in print and someone talking about that um so that was all was actually very good um i would definitely recommend it for anybody that um it, it's not a book a, it, although it's a book about pakistani culture it's not like a kind of travel log or anything like that it's just about one guy's reflections over the years about certain aspects of Pakistani culture. So I think, but yeah, I think if you are interested in, um, in, you know, um, in, in Pakistani culture, I guess, you know, this would be a good book to get. Uh, yeah, I would, I would definitely recommend it. And, and I would say it's well written as well. Okay. It's available. Oh, uh, it's available on. It's available as an ebook, and of course you can buy it. And I think it looks like it's been printed by Amazon. 
by a publisher called Tranquil Bar, but I'm sure you'll be able to get this quite easily. Um, who else has given it a recommendation? Oh, various, various people. Anyway, that's that. That's my first book review recently, okay?